Good afternoon. Actually, good evening, good almost. Evening. No, actually, not really. It's only 4.35. It feels later, doesn't it? It so does hot. feel later because it's a bit cold. The old heater's working there, kind of, but trouble is, it's bigger here now, so the heat doesn't circulate that good. Anyway, I thought we'd bring something different to the table today, and it's Carlsberg Premium Export Pilsner, an old school favourite. Mm -hmm. It's in a 660ml bottle, it comes in at 4.8% ABV and I think you get three for a fiver in Asda at the moment, something like that anyway. We couldn't find a Carlsberg pint pot, um, so, so we've, got we've got a little one, you know, it's the thought that counts, isn't it? Because I kind of feel, it feels better drinking it in the correct glass if possible. We have got a Carlsberg pint somewhere that you pinch from the pub. Indeed, I just couldn't find it. No. So, I mean... They say probably the best beer in the world. I don't <laughs> quite agree with that. But there you go. Right, now let's give it a pour. You can show them and I'll take this quick snap. Whoa. Oh, okay. There you go. Okay. So Step there's the water. And there we have the drink. Yep. Maybe a quick snapper. Huh? It's going to be an odd picture because. Yeah, the last of, big bottle. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> size of the last of the bottle, but no, uh, better than nothing, can it? It's the thought that counts, people. You know that, didn't you? Oh, we had the calendar. Right, there we go. Oh, that's bad. Because you've got the light shining mm. on. Good combination. Yeah. Right. That'll do, anyway. Let's get on. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Well, let's get it. Carbonation. Um, I mean, what can you say about Carlsberg? You talk about the original Carlsberg, yeah, you dread it, you go into a pub, you see yeah. Carlsberg, you think, no way, Pedro. That's like the, the Danish version of Foster's. It Australia's is. Foster's, but yeah. not really Australia's Foster's, as we all know. But with the old export, now when I remember back in the day, that was a different ball game. Because when you see Carlsberg export, like Heineken, um, Heineken or Holston export, you were like, ooh, yeah. This is good. I mean, we used to go to Asia a lot. Hopefully, we'll go back one day. And it was always Carlsberg, well, they used to call it premium, didn't they? Mm. It was always sort of like 5%. I'm sure this used to be a bit stronger. Yeah, I, I thought it used to be stronger than that. If my memory serves me well, but obviously with that UK crap for the tax and everything, they brought the old anti down, haven't they? So well, I haven't tried this for knowingly. For I was going to say, down. I can't remember the last time I tried this. It's a little bit hot. Well, I know I've had a cold lately, but it's supposed to be a bit malty. But yeah, that's all I'm picking up. Maybe. There's, not, there's not a lot to it, is there? Yeah, a bit more. That's basically all I'm getting off that. There's no, there's no mango coming and jumping out here, mate, I'll tell you. No, there's not, there's not a lot no. there, is there? Right, okay. But, you know, the carbonation is still yeah, really still good. There. It's not an inflated glass, it's a frosted glass. Yeah, it's frosted. Where did we get that from? We've had it years, um, haven't we? We acquired it from somewhere. You mean you pinched it in your handbag? I've told her many times for steaming glasses, it's just wrong. Right, mm. okay. Mmm. Who knows? That's. Oh, okay. That's surprisingly smooth. Yeah, it's not true. I mean, yeah, it's. it's, it's it's a basic pill smell, as we said in it, but do you know what? Ain't off bad. Yeah, the malt and the hops are quite nicely balanced, aren't they? Yeah, there's no... What does it say here? Goldsberg uh, Premium Pills, well, I don't know about this premium, but there you go. They did used to call it premium in Malaysia, didn't they? Yeah, compared to the um, ordinary Goldsberg, that is a big improvement. Yeah. That's actually drinkable. Yeah, this is their master brewer that makes this. Mm. I'll tell you what, I'm not to get hold of their normal brewer. I'll tell you, <laughs> whack him. That rotten old Carlsberg. But that, that's surprising me. It's, it's, 
It's not that bad, you know. Yeah. I'll tell you what, I've sucked worse in pubs. It's, it's quite a, a balanced mouthful that you're getting there. The carbonation. It's, yeah, the carbonation moves the flavours around your mouth nicely as well. And the malt, yeah, it's not too strong yeah. anyway, but... They're nicely balanced off with the hops, there's no bitterness there, it's it's very smooth, easy drinking, isn't it? Yeah, for, for, for a standard, bog standard pills, I mean, you think, 660ml, you're getting five for a, a three for a fiver. Mm. That ain't a bad deal, is it? No, that's not, that's not half bad at all. I mean, yeah, all right, I'd take... Four bottles of Frankie <laughs> for six quid. One, to, uh, you know, but this lager's got. I was saying we stayed away from this for ages, haven't yeah. we? It's not actually that bad. No, it's not. No, it's you're not going to stay there and shout your mouth out. But for price comparisons, it ain't that bad, is it? I can't believe for, I'm for saying that. For standard pills, it, it's very drinkable. It's quite easy going, isn't it? After liking after liking Colin Premier last week, we ain't gonna have no subscribers left at this rate. <laughs> so um, sorry, I'll subscribe to myself, so I'll always have one. Oh, you know, I'm, I didn't hold out a lot of hope for this, to be honest. Well, that's why I sat there for two months. Yeah. It was either this or the old Rattler, and I thought, no. <laughs> let's have a lager. <laughs> so cider's more for a hot day, but <coughs> I'd say there's not. It's self-explanatory, isn't it? Yeah. It is what it is. It's a bog standard pills. It is. But, but it ain't a bad The flavours in there, the malts, the hops, everything is well balanced off. It, it's got quite a smooth finish to it. Um, it doesn't leave anything unpleasant There's no in the bitter aftertaste. aftertaste at all. It's, yeah. It's, you get some of the old cheap rank lovers, mm. the aftertaste, you're like, ah, that is, that's actually all right. Quite shocked. Yeah, it was better than I expected. Mm. Yeah. yeah. I don't say I'll go out my way and buy it again. Do you know, but next time I go to someone's house, I don't get invited anywhere really, but if I did go to someone's <laughs> house and they had a Carlsberg export, yeah, I'd be I'd like, be, oh yeah, I'll have that, that's all right. That. It's, yeah. not, it's, not, it's, not, it's, not, it's not great by any sense of the world, but 660 mil times three for a fiver, that's not bad going. Mm -hmm. That's nearly four pints. You can't look back, can you? It is almost four pints, mm. 125 a pint. 4.8, not going to blow I'm your mind. I'm sure it used to be stronger than that. Yeah, it did, definitely. Yeah. Definitely used to be stronger. It's not going to blow your mind, but it's not offensive. It's not like your 4% yeah. standard card. But obviously, like Stella, they've reduced it down. But you know what? I'm I've got to go yes on that. Yeah, I'm going to go on the yes on this, and I'm going to give it um, a 7. It's, yeah, I agree yeah, with you. A, great, a fair 7 out of 10. Seven. For the price and that, and yeah. you could drink a lot worse, you know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. You imagine running out of beer, go down your lake, Lasda, bang go. Yeah. Not that we're going to run out of beer, but if we did. <laughs> we did too. Yeah, no, but we used to. If we did, oh, shush. <laughs> See, the old Hobart I want to. Yeah, it's cool in us. <laughs> but yeah, definite yes from both of us, yeah. and a definite seven. Um, let us know if you find this offensive. Yeah. You know? Let us know. Be interested to hear anyone's thoughts. Right, bonjour, people. See ya.